how are we all doing? I hope you're keeping well out there. I hope you're enjoying your evening. So, things are going well with the old YouTube channel. I'm quite happy with the whole uh, progress of the thing. You know, over 1100 subscribers now. So we we're keep edging upwards and upwards, which is good. Um, thank you all for your support. You're all very good to me. Uh, always nice comments and, and support. And it's, 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 it is greatly appreciated. So I just want to take that time to say that you're probably sick of hearing me say that but i do like to throw it out there now and again because if you're not watching me there's no channel and if there's no channel then there's no point putting the videos up so i'm glad that uh some of you out there get a bit of entertainment out of and that's all it's about it's just a bit of crack uh after all they're only old tellies and they're only old radios and if they weren't here to be in the bin so that's the story so hope you're all keeping well out there i was asked to have a look at this Sony clock radio. She's from the late 80s or early 90s I'm told. Um, I'd believe it. Um, it just stopped working. So it was bin bound. But um, when I heard of its fate I said sure give it to me. I'll have a look at it for you and try and you know, it'll save you getting a new one. If we can get it going again. So um, we'll have a look at it. I'll bring the camera in and we'll have a quick squint. We won't waste too much time on it either, but if we can get it going again, that'd be all the better. Any of these things that are saved from the old recycling center, the old bin, the old e-waste, because everyone thinks they're doing a great thing when they bring their out of date 18 month old TV down to the recycling center down to their local amenity place to get recycled and they go home with a clear conscience but what they don't see is that then you know it goes onto a bow and it goes off to some nation where the people are not as well off as we are and they take over it in a dump looking for bits of copper and bits of lead and whatever taking out bits and pieces and you know life is fairly hard for those people and it's just a waste I think anyway uh, what will we do? We'll check the plug first. I, pl I did plug it in, and I, as you can see, it doesn't light up. Um, it is dead on arrival, so we'll do the. We'll try and stick to the basic things first if we can, because we can have a habit of going off in tangents at times, and that's not good. How many times have we gone fall finding on the out to have a blowing fuse in the plug socket or something silly? Well, here, in this establishment, it's happened more than once. A good 13 amp fuse in there. That should be uh, sufficient for a clock radio. Right. That's the easy part. Let's see. Are we getting that up? No. All right. I wonder, is it the main transformer? It would not be unheard of. that back together there. we will open up the radio and have a quick squint inside and see if it is indeed the man's transformer and if it is yeah, we might have one that will fit get a screwdriver that fits first John Joe always oh, ask mm-hmm I got these extra long screwdrivers and littles the other week. They're actually quite handy. Um, give them a good spin, you know. And some of the old TVs, you needed the extra long screwdriver to get down into the screw holes. They're not the kind of TVs we really do here. I'm talking about 90s. Big black plastic jobs. And she sort of cracked there. I wonder did I have a fall. Well that's not doing that. That sounds like the... The post is going around. So... I wonder 
did it get smashed against the wall because I did notice there is a little crack on the in the cabinet yeah no, it might have went off and someone wasn't in the room when I get now bed mm, there's a little crack here mm, the cabinet's cracked there I think I see what's wrong here. Come on. Oh, come on. The post is going around and it's cut and it's holding the whole thing in. Now I've managed to get my forceps in here and I'm holding the broken post on the other side of the board. Nothing simple, is there? Right, after months of fluting around, we managed to bend things far more than we wanted to bend them, but you see, that was my problem. And that was caught on the circuit board going around. So we couldn't get the back off. So we sort of had no choice. So it's not looking good for you little radio. But, um, I'm sure we may take the bar out now with my ass. So AC in straight up to the primary of the transformer and we did check across the leads going into the, the plug where we get nothing but we'll just go across the primary here and we'll see do we get nothing a knob. <clears throat> it's open circuit. I'm not going to fix that. And of course, it's a board mounted job as well. <sighs> Let's see if I've anything suitable in stock. Now, I had a route around, and believe it or not, I found a very similar Sony transformer in a scrap radio I had here. The only difference being is the pin layout on the board and this one has a what you call it tags on it but that doesn't matter but you see on this one you centre pin on either side is two over whereas these are here so I'm going to try and move these pins over so they line up with the board and we'll be in business and I have checked it and the primary is okay on it Okay, there was a bit of messing around, but we got our replacement transformer in. So, moment of truth. Ah, success. Now, of course, it's not going to work because the switch is in the thing like that. So, I'll stick it back together. And we'll see how she performs. Okay, so that's good. And it's I like the way that there's anchor tabs on this transformer as well. And the holes line up perfectly. So that takes a bit of strain off the solder joints too. Which can only be welcomed. Thank you. 
We're on um We're on long wave here. Let's turn off some of this noisy crap. I'll bring the camera in a bit closer. Oh, I didn't line up the uh, volume control right. Hmm. It's working anyway. I think that's a result. Right. I'll box it up proper. Okay, so I've I've even went to the effort of setting the time on it and it's half ten at night here. Bad medium wave later. Okay, I think I can call that a success. I'll give it a little clean and we'll give them a nice surprise. Lovely, thanks for watching and as always, enjoy yourselves out there. Stay safe and I'll talk to you again soon. Thank you, good luck.